Dear learners, we from the discipline of history, Kistakanta Hondigo State Open University are offering a course entitled Introduction to Assam History for undergraduate learners of second semester. I, Dr. Priti Kholila Raskwa, welcome you all to this course. The course is prepared for both discipline-specific core and discipline-specific elective learners. That means learners having history as their DSC or discipline specific core course or discipline specific elective may enroll in this course. This is an introductory course to introduce the learners with the history of this beautiful land having its diverse cultural backgrounds. The course is of four credits consisting of 40 videos broadly divided into 14 units covering from ancient to modern period of Assam. Now, let me highlight the objective of this course. The objective of this course is to provide undergraduate learners with a comprehensive introduction to the history and culture of Assam, to explore the rich historical evolution of Assam, encompassing ancient, medieval, and modern periods, to familiarize the learners with the diverse sources and materials essential for understanding the history of Assam. Next, to analyze the governance, societal structures, economic paradigms, and religious modalities prevalent in ancient Assam. To equip learners with the tools to navigate historical sources related to medieval Assam, focusing on political regimes of post palo period, the Ahoms and the Coaches. Next objective of this course is to explore socio-economic transformations during colonialism the emergence of political consciousness and Assam's role in the national movement, providing a holistic understanding of Assam's historical process. Now, let me focus the content of this course. What are there in this course? Assam, a northeastern state of India, is rich in history, culture, and natural beauty. Its history is characterized by a blend of indigenous cultures, migrations, invasions, and trade making it a diverse and vibrant region. It is an introductory course to the history of Assam and covering from ancient to modern period of Assam. The study of ancient Assam is intricately detailed across multiple units, each offering a unique perspective on the region's historical evolution. The first unit, Sources of Early Assam, serves as a foundational introduction elucidating the diverse materials and sources essential for understanding ancient Assam's history and its contemporary relevance. Moving into specific egos, the second unit, legendary period, delves into the reign of Naraka and his successors, setting the stage before the Ahom dynasty's arrival. The subsequent unit, ruling dynasties of early Assam, delves deeply into the political landscape enabling a comprehensive grasp of early ruling dynasties and their significant accomplishment. Transitioning to the governance and societal structures, the fourth unit, Administration of Early Assam, meticulously dissects state affairs, societal frameworks, economic paradigms, religious modalities, and administrative protocols prevalent in ancient Assam. Further, delving into societal aspects, the fifth unit, Society, Economy, Religion of Ali Assam, illuminates the social fabric, economic dynamics, and religious practices prevalent during that era. Then shifting focus to the medieval Assam, which is an important part of history of Assam. The sixth unit, Sources of History of Medieval Assam, equips learners with tools to navigate various historical sources pertinent to this period. Subsequent units delve into specific colonial regimes such as political conditions in the post palo period and the Ahoms and the Coaches, highlighting the Komotapur, Barabhunyas, Sutiyas, Kacharis, and the establishment of governance of the Ahom and the Coach dynasty. The historical continuum is raised by units on socio-economic transformations during colonialism, the emergence of political consciousness, 
among the Assamese people and Assam's active participation in the national movement. These units collectively paint a vivid picture of Assam's historical tapestry. From ancient rulers to colonial influences and down to the political awakening and nationalist movement. After completion of this course, learners will gain a comprehensive understanding of historical evolution of Assam, spanning from ancient times to the modern era. This includes knowledge of major dynasties, rulers, cultural affairs, and socio-political developments. Now, at the end of this presentation, I would like to summarize the outlines of this course once again. This course is for four-year undergraduate program. The name of the course is Introduction to History of Assam, and it is for the second semester learners. The learners having history as their discipline-specific core, that means DSC, and discipline-specific elective, DSE, may enroll in this course. Total credit of this course is four credit. So these are the main outlines of this course. Once again, I would like to welcome you all to this course. Thank you. Thank you very much.